Hey crew, so this is the last segment I'll be doing and filming tonight. And this is basically what I've been doing. Take a look at that. And basically, you guys, the way I've been doing that is with sculpting. Sculpey. <laughs> you take a little bit of it, turn it into a ball, make sure you work it because if you don't, it crumbles really quick. I mean, look at that. You break a piece off of it and it just, it crumbles away. So you have to turn it into a little ball and you have to work it a little bit. And then once you get a piece of it, I'm gonna add, I'm gonna call this one the Spray Can King. Yeah, now check this out, guys. What you do is you take a spray cap, you draw little points on it. I used an X-Acto knife. I can't show you an X-Acto knife right now, but get an X-Acto knife and you start cutting it up until you leave it like this. See that? Take that piece off. Look. Eh? How cool is that? So I'll be adding the hair. I'm not going to get too detailed on it. I'm, it's not like I'm going to put any ears or hair or anything like that. I just thought I'd do something neat sculpting wise. I haven't sculpted in a while. And uh, in case you guys didn't know, I used, to, I used to do it actually quite a bit. And so I thought this would be a fun little, little project to have. Maybe this can uh, hold some of my books up or I'm not sure. Here, let me, let me zoom in so you guys can take a better look at the details. I haven't added the, uh, the eyes yet. I added the nose. Um, added the mouth. Still needs a little bit of work on there. Added a chin. And I don't know if you guys remember it. I actually I actually started working on it. I had a little bit of a caulk and I had added the caulk first. I thought it would be a little easier to work with. But that is not the case. And so what I did is I went home, got some of my Sculpey and put it on top and just started working the areas. And the way you do that is you have to rub, constantly be rubbing. See, it almost looks like marble in certain areas. You see that? That's just my dirty fingers, guys, because it, the Sculpey is white. And so when you're doing this and your hands are dirty, you create those lines. So I thought that was actually a pretty neat, um, pretty neat look too but I'm not gonna leave it like that. And if you guys know anything about Sculpey, I think it dries uh, if you just let it sit outside for a little bit. You can also stick it in the oven. Uh, I don't wanna do that. I'm just gonna leave it, let it dry by itself. And um, paint it. Once it's dry, I'm gonna paint it. Yep. So what do you guys think? Should I add a mustache, maybe a beard? Maybe I should, huh? Nice little mustache going on here. Nice flowing beard. But anyways, there it is, guys. Little Sculpey. Uh, I, I definitely want to see what you guys come up with. I thought about doing maybe, um, like you could do a skull too. You know, can you imagine? Uh, different little characters. And that would be pretty cool. I thought about sculpting a hand, grabbing the can. And... I don't know, maybe adding a light inside of it, but anyways, there it is, guys. Pretty crafty stuff today, and tomorrow, tomorrow I have a nice little surprise for you guys as well. So stay tuned, and as we continue to to do creative stuff, let's let's recap what we've done today. Take a look at that. We did a little night light. Remember. We cut out the star, drill a hole here on the bottom. In fact, let me see if I can show you guys. Drill a hole in the bottom, used one of these clear sheets, cut a piece of it, rolled it up, and stuck it down here. And when you stick it down here, it unrolls by itself, and that's what you get right there. Yeah, take a look at that. Awesome. Uh, remember, we bought some of these and that's what's actually keeping it on and then well now we're working on this so yeah pretty crafty stuff huh guys uh you know what i'm actually thinking about maybe doing a lamp tomorrow and i actually bought the stuff for it let me show you 
So we're going to get some empty cans. We're going to cut them up. And I don't know. You know what? I really thought about maybe putting a can over it, but eh, I didn't really quite like the idea of it. Maybe we can um, cut some stuff out of it. Uh, perhaps maybe logos, a Spicasso logo, or cut it in the shape of like tree branches all over the place. And when you put a light inside of it, it creates this really cool effect on the wall. Uh, so that might be an idea. Or you know what, guys, the easiest thing to do. Cut a hole through it. Imagine that. And just make it a spray paint lamp. I don't know. Let me uh, put your comments. Let me know what you think. And then based on your votes and on your opinions, maybe we can uh, do something like that tomorrow. All right, crew. Well, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's tutorial. Until next time, keep those cans shaking, guys. And don't throw away your empty cans. Maybe we can create some pretty nifty little night lights or something cool for the house. All right, until then, we'll see you guys later. Bye.